Good morning, everybody on YouTube. This is Rick Thomas from Obsolete Video. Today, I was going to discuss uh, people who are going to watch the Super Bowl tomorrow. Uh, I don't know if many of you people out there have the capabilities of recording the game. I, I get asked this from a lot of different people. People ask me, how do you record television on your computer? I did one for Thanksgiving, uh, I, the Macy's Parade. But I'm going to do one now talking about the Super Bowl, okay? If you're recording the game, you do have to be kind of set up for it. If you're, on, if you're in a system such as me for broadcast and television, um, my system is set up for recording directly off my cable system. And uh, I'm going to walk you through this a little bit, give you an idea what it's like to be able to record television directly to a computer, to high-definition files. And especially people who collect Super Bowl games, they like to have the recordings. They're big collectors of these. I have a friend of mine who likes to have the game, and he, he collects all the Super Bowls, and he likes to have them on a Blu-ray disc. And so I will make him a Blu-ray disc of this game after I record it directly off of cable. Now, how do you do this? Okay, as you can see, I got open. It's This, this is a capture software, okay? As you can see, I've got the uh, uh, Fox, you know, the Fox channel on, and I'm just doing a little video here to show you. And I can record anything off of television that's on my cable system. Now, I do have a cable system. It's by Cox, Cox Cable. And this is a mini box, okay? And basically, these mini boxes, if you have Cox Cable, you really cannot do much with them. You do need some equipment in between, and you need to be able to set it up. So let me explain to you how I do this. Okay. I have what's called capture cards by StarTech. I don't know if you can see these. See that one down there? That's my StarTech high quality capture card. And uh, I've owned two of these. I, I kind of really do enjoy this capture card. Okay. And that plugs directly into USB. And you can do uh, HDMI direct from HDMI, HDMI directly into that box. Okay. So if you can record cable TV, here's the problem. If you have a Cox cable box, you cannot go directly out of the uh, HDMI output to a capture card like uh, this one here that StarTech that does have, that has HDMI. You can't do a direct plug-in from one to the other, okay? Uh, most cable systems, cable boxes, uh, you know, uh, satellite boxes, stuff like that, they have what's called uh, copy guard encryption. It's an HCP, HP, something like that, uh, copy guard on it. And you can't just plug and play right into the boxes to capture to like a computer recording like this because the actual uh, signal is blocked coming out of boxes like this. And you need what's called a copy guard stripper. And I've got one down here I'll show you. As you can see that right there, that's a copy guard stripper. I go uh, into that directly out of the uh, cable box that I have here to the stripper, which is down there, directly into the capture card, which allows it to bypass all copy guards so, you can, so the cable box channels come right up in the, ca in the capture that you're doing. And um, it's, uh, it's very important that you have one of these. It's, called, it's a copy guard stripper for HDMI. You can get them on eBay if they're even still sold. I know the cable companies and a lot of other the television industries were just bitching up a storm because they knew people were able to do this. They don't want you to be able to record television in high quality. This is where we are today, folks. Remember when you used to have VCRs, you'd be able to record TV, anything you want. Nowadays, with high definition and professional recordings and various different things that you get broadcast quality, the networks and TV stations do not want you to record their programs. So if you notice, the only recording you could do is like on, uh, you know, uh, some of those, uh, I don't know what you call them, boxes that you would get from cable where you can actually record TV, but you can't actually copy from those files to like a DVD storage or something like that. They're very encrypted. And uh, DVR, I guess they call them. DVRs are useless. You can record to the hard drive, but you can't record off of the drive to save the files to something else because it's not recorded in like a like a video file it's very unusual and that's the only type of tv recording systems that's really out right now so 
so you can't actually record any programs like the Super Bowl or anything. This is the best way of doing it. If you have a broadcast or a television set up in your home, such as myself, I have Cox Cable, and I use what's called a stripper box that removes the copy guard from the capture uh, of the cable box to the capture card itself that brings up the picture into my system. That's how I do it. Uh, like I said, if you ever want to be able to record directly to your computer and you got a really expensive computer to be able to do it like I do, it is possible. But uh, again, guys, television stations today have designed their cable systems and things to keep people from recording TV right off the air. They don't want you doing that no more. That's why they put all these copy guard boxes out. They're trying to keep people from being able to save programs permanently like on a disc or a file for safekeeping for collectors and things like that. That's what it's all about. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video.